What is the difference between pelagic and benthic zones? Have you ever wondered about the different worlds beneath the oceans' surface? Today, we are going to explore the fascinating differences between the pelagic and benthic zones. These two zones are essential parts of marine ecosystems, each with its unique features and inhabitants. The pelagic zone is the open water column of the ocean. It stretches from the surface down to just above the ocean floor, but it does not include the bottom itself. This zone is home to a variety of organisms that swim, float, or drift in the water. You might find fish, marine mammals, and even tiny plankton here. The pelagic zone can be divided into several layers based on depth. The epipelagic zone is the sunlit surface layer, while the mesopelagic zone is known as the twilight zone. Deeper down, you have the abyssopelagic and hadopelagic zones, which are found in the very deep ocean waters. On the other hand, the benthic zone is located at the very bottom of the ocean. This zone includes the ocean floor and the sediment that lies on it. It stretches from shallow coastal areas to the deep abyssal plains and trenches. The organisms that live in the benthic zone, known as benthos, include clams, crabs, sea stars, and various microorganisms. These creatures thrive on or within the seabed, where they have adapted to the specific conditions of their environment. One of the main differences between these two zones is their location. The pelagic zone is all about the open water, while the benthic zone is focused on the ocean floor. The types of organisms found in each zone also differ. In the pelagic zone, you will find swimmers and floaters, such as fish and plankton. In contrast, the benthic zone is home to creatures that live on or in the sediment. Environmental conditions play a significant role in shaping these zones. The pelagic zone experiences variations in depth and light availability, while the benthic zone is characterized by different substrate types and generally darker conditions. The benthic zone is also more stable physically compared to the pelagic zone. When we talk about zonation, the pelagic zone includes coastal shelf waters, known as the Neritic Province, and the Open Ocean, referred to as the Oceanic Province. The benthic zone corresponds to these areas but focuses on the habitats found at the bottom. Understanding these two zones is essential for studying marine ecosystems. They representing distinct habitats with unique biological communities and ecological processes. For instance, the pelagic zone is vital for fisheries targeting open water species, while the benthic zone supports organisms that relying on the seafloor for food and shelter. In summary, the pelagic zone is the vast open water area filled with free-swimming and floating organisms, while the benthic zone is the ocean bottom habitat where creatures live on or in the sediment. Both zones are critical components of marine ecosystems, each supporting specialized communities adapted to their specific environmental conditions.